a whole lot more and working out this morning. Oh, yes. Hi, guys. Good morning. I think uh, we all certainly missed the gym during our sheltering in place. Take a look around. It looks busy. It also looks quiet. That is because the academy in Sacramento decided to slowly open up back their doors with just personal training. They just kicked that off on Monday and then obviously eventually we'll get back to hosting full time classes. Brian here, the owner. Good morning to you. Good morning. Hello. Hello. So I think there was a big fat question mark for a lot of gyms out there trying to figure out how do you have your clients come back in, but then be safe and healthy all while doing so. And it looks like you certainly figured it out. Yeah, we didn't want to go with our full opening just yet with having 20 people in classes, along with having all of our personal trainers in. So the goal was to try to figure out how we can make this work. Um, so this was kind of our test of that. If we can do this with personal trainers, if we can give them the space to be able to work with their clients, yeah. see how we can get people in and out safely, I think we'd be ready for opening up full time next week. Yep, and I see all your personal trainers right now with masks on. What exactly are you all doing outside of wearing masks. So we are cleaning like crazy. Every trainer here is required to not only wear a mask while they're training, but they're also required to walk around with water bottles. I shouldn't say water bottles, but in these water <laughs> bottles is a solution um, that is going to help us keep everything clean. We're making sure that we are sanitizing everything. We're asking people to wash their hands when they walk in the door, asking them to wash their hands when they leave. We've got buckets of wipes that are sitting out so that um, the gym members themselves can wipe things down. So yeah, we are taking every precaution that we can to keep people safe. Okay, so uh, Brian, I have never done personal training, but I'll tell you, he has uh, some weights out for me, guys. I'm gonna do a little workout. Now, I really honestly want to try to get a J-Lo booty one of these days, but I think we could work on the arms for now. Work on the arms for a bit. So okay. you, you can go ahead and grab these dumbbells. Okay. These yeah. dumbbells look like eight pound dumbbells. I can assure you that they are 80 pound dumbbells, okay? okay? Uh, All right, I want you to hold these 80 pound dumbbells. You're gonna do a curl. Now press that dumbbell up and over here. There you go. Bring that dumbbell down all the way. Switch and go with the other hand. Curl, press all the way up and over here. All right, you can do that 100 times. I'm just joking. You're only going to do that 10 times. Good. Look at that. You look great. This is beautiful. You squeeze your shoulders back just a little bit. Beautiful. Look at that. There it is right there. One a good weight is anywhere between like you know what's comfortable to you what's going to challenge you when you get down to that last rep you want to be challenged when you get to the last rep so a good weight is always something that challenges you. all right how do i look guys there you go yep. i'll show that a little later let me work on that a little longer and then show you those guns okay really quick when you in fact do open up for the public to take uh, public classes together how's that going to look on the 22nd when we do that we're going to have people check in through our app um you're going to sign in ahead of time for classes uh we're going to cap our classes at 20 people um, that will give us the space to be able to get people in and out of the studio. We're also going to shorten our classes from an hour to 45 minutes to give us 15 minutes to clean up after people leave and usher new people in. All right, sounds good. Brian, always a pleasure. Thank you so much. Thank you. And also, you guys, if you don't know, the Academy uh, has had a lot of professional athletes, NFL in, and NBA, come out of this facility. So certainly a good place to work out. I'm going to get my arms ready and my J-Lo booty <laughs> just as ready to go. There you go. You got 99 or 95 more reps. It's amazing cake, how <laughs> much it. Brian's arms look like mine. <laughs> yeah, it was